Let's move on uh, mm -hmm. to Colorado. Again, here, Colorado dealing with those floods. A headline from their paper, the Denver Post, uh, talking about be uh, beleaguered Estes Park acutely feels the pain of yeah. its neighboring park's closure. Mm -hmm. And that, of course, is the is the area where those floods were. And it's not just the, the, the parks that are closed that's having an impact on this. I, I think the Colorado residents should be the most outraged about this. Not only are there about 200 members of the Colorado National Guard who have been furloughed, who right. are working to rebuild those roads and bridges that go to the small towns in the mountains that were so affected by the flooding. But also, there are about 120 Utah National Guardsmen uh, who were going to fly to Colorado. Their mission has now been delayed. They're not going to be able to fly out there until there's an impasse done. And by the way, let's not forget, they're racing against winter. There is, oh, you know, yeah. the snows are yeah, coming, yeah. and if the snow hits before they're able to repair these roads, the roads aren't going to be repaired until until the spring. We're talking about entire communities being shut off. Yeah, and the race there, Tom Tancredo against Governor uh, John Hickenloop, yeah. Or has it any effect on that? Any That's, sort of, I mean, Hickenlooper, so, yeah. Hickenlooper has been very aggressive in, in combating the uh, the flooding. The, the race where I'm watching this, this particular, how this plays out, is uh, a, a house race just south of the Denver area where Republican Congressman Mike Kaufman is running for re-election. He doesn't represent any of the communities that were affected by the right. flooding, but he's in a, a district that's changing really rapidly. A lot of Hispanic voters are moving in there. Uh, Democrats think they can flip that seat at some point. Point, this may be the time when he has to separate himself from the National Republican Party. We've already seen him try to do that yeah. on a few other bills. This is going to be a big challenge. And Obamacare, him. we know, very popular uh, with Latinos. 